Hi everybody. Recently I've been asked what is the difference between dynamic and static stretches and which one is the better one to use. And so I wanted to explain a little bit about the two. A dynamic stretch functions through movement. So we're using movement to achieve that stretch. And a dynamic stretch involves more than one muscle. It involves more than one muscle group. And it has usually an effect on that entire fascial line. So you can picture that like you're opening up a path in the jungle through the movement, through the continuous movement. We're opening up that path in your body further and further and further. And so we can go slowly deeper into that stretch, but gentle enough that your body won't resist that. And so it's an ideal way to use a dynamic stretch before exercise because it opens up that muscle, it warms it up, it creates more blood flow, it opens up the joints around it. Um, and um, if you don't use it around exercise, you can easily use it at any given point in your day, whenever you find time for it. Um, and then a static stretch is, again, like the word implies, you're holding a position, you're holding a stretch to um, lengthen one particular muscle or lengthen one particular muscle group. Usually it is very isolated and involves one muscle or one muscle group. Um, it, is, uh, it is an ideal way for uh, um, for your to tell your body to cool down so it's a good way to use after exercise because a static stretch will tell your body to slow down to relax and to tell your muscles to relax and so it's a good way to use it as a cool down <clears throat> um, most importantly what I find is you need to ask your body what feels good for your body what gives you the biggest benefit um, not just as you're doing this stretch, which as we know can be a little uncomfortable, but then right after, the day after. So keep asking your body, hey, what do you like? What feels good? What works well? And the more you do that, the more information you will get from your body. And um, that's pretty much the difference between dynamic and static stretches. To recap that, dynamic stretches I would always use before exercise as a warm-up or just as a general stretch throughout the day. A static stretch I would most likely use after exercise. And again, all of us react to different things, so it is totally up to you to figure out what does my body like, what does my body respond to the best. And if you want to learn more about that or have one of us show you what would be the ideal stretch for you, figure this all out with your body um, and give you more of a personalized stretch for whatever feels tight in your body, um, come on in, give us a call um, at 512-215-4227. My name is Alexis and I hope I see you soon in the studio. Have a wonderful day.